The city of Lubbock has had plans to develop McAllister Park for years, and some of those projects have been delayed by the supply chain. KLBK's Elizabeth Fitz visited the park today and got some exciting updates. Elizabeth? The city tells me McAllister Dog Park is set to open in just a few weeks, and as a dog mom myself, this park has some really cool amenities from bathrooms to water fountains for dogs and humans, and then lights so our dogs can play outside at night without having to get in that West Texas heat. There's three different sections to this dog park. This large area that we're seeing right now, then we have one for small dogs, and we will be having a, a section that we're, we're going to call the Agility Park, where we hope to have jumps and things like that. Between the Marsha Sharp and Spur 327 in southwest Lubbock, when finished, McAllister Dog Park will span five acres of land. This will become a destination location for people that are coming. Maybe they're just coming here for the weekend, but they'll know that this park is here, and, and it's it's so nice that you could spend you could easily spend the uh, majority of an afternoon here with uh, friends and family and your dog. And that's not the only up and coming development here. The city is adding a food truck area, pickleball courts, covered basketball courts, and the Milestones Indoor Sensory Playground. Our goal is to find more public-private partnerships uh, like we did with the, the dog park. Many of these amenities would not be possible without community partnerships. And in the coming years, the city hopes to build a skate park and splash pad. But regardless of the activity, people know that McAllister Park is here and it's going to be magnificent. The Parks and Recreation Department has been out here all day to add some cosmetic touches and they tell me that there will be an opening ceremony sometime this summer. Reporting from McAllister Park, Elizabeth Fitz, KLBK News.